my car right now. I'm already running late. And this is the inside of my car. So now I have to sit here for the next, I don't even know how long, and try to get this stuff to defrost, which is annoying as heck. So just bumped up to the top of my Christmas wish list is a remote starter so I can do this junk while I'm still inside the house because this is crazy look you can't even see outside remote starter on my list officially hey guys it's me mrs. T and today um, I'm just doing a little bit of errands and stuff you guys saw me earlier leaving for school drop-offs and to say that I was ticked off on how frosted over my car was is like not even enough to say. <laughs> um, I was aggravated because like I don't go outside and like check how frosty it is before I leave. So I always end up getting caught off guard and like with minutes to spare and then to have to sit there and wait for everything to defrost. I have officially placed a request on my Christmas wish list or after Christmas I don't even care for a remote start to be like installed on my car ASAP because that thing is really needed but right now um, I'm headed over to get some Starbucks why because Starbucks was doing a 12 days of Christmas thing and even though this is the last day and I totally like flaked out on doing it every day today if you get a brewed tea you get um, four bonus stars with your purchase, which is awesome. So that's what I'm heading over to do. And I wanna try this new tea called like, I think it's Rubius tea. Well, it's not a new tea, but it's new to me because I never tried it before. It's called a Rubius tea. And it's supposed to be like really, um, sorry, really fruity and I really wanna try it out. So that's what I'm gonna get. And I'll talk to you guys in a bit. Hi guys, I'm back in the car which is probably gonna be most of my day today. But I did wanna ask you guys a couple questions today about Christmas wrapping. So I have been talking to a few of the ladies at the NC Blogger Network event a couple of weeks ago, and they were telling me about their wrapping traditions and stuff, and a couple of them I honestly had never heard of. Um, one was that whatever, well, first was a toy tradition. Whatever toys their kids asked for from Santa, like say they sat on Santa's lap and asked him for something, those toys were like guaranteed and those gifts they did not wrap under the tree instead they would just place them under the tree like a toy land presentation totally unwrapped and just like sat set up nicely and i had never heard of this because in my family and growing up we always wrapped our gifts so i was like oh that's an interesting you know tradition because that's less wrapping for mom or dad, right? And then I also heard of another tradition where they don't wrap any of the toys. They just put them all out like a Toyland presentation. So I just wanted to know, how do you wrap your Christmas presents? Like, do you wrap the ones from family and friends and you, like mom and dad, and leave out the ones that are quote unquote from Santa? Or do you wrap everything? Like, what do you do? Um, Cause personally, my kids are kind of past the um, Santa thing stupid glare sorry guys they're kind of past santa claus because my seven now seven year old caught me when she was about three or four wrapping presents and it just totally blew the myth for her like she's like okay there's no santa it's mom she's doing it and that's the end of it now her my youngest daughter she totally still believes in santa claus like she just knows he's the one dropping everything off i'm trying to block the glare he's the one dropping everything off and that's just it that's all she needs to know and then my three-year-old he is kind of on the fence because he hears it from both of them what they think it is and he's like eh, I don't know it could be my it could be Santa I'm not sure so I never really have to do the whole Santa Claus brought this type thing and I don't label their stuff like that so they don't really have that issue but I am thinking about twerking or twerking wow not twerking tweaking the unwrapped tradition a bit and maybe leaving like a couple of their toys unwrapped and wrapping the rest of them so i'm gonna think about it and i'm not sure but let me know down in the comments what some of your christmas traditions are as far as wrapping toys and santa beliefs and all of that 
Okay, because I'd love to know. I'm kind of interested. All right, I'll talk to you guys later. Smooches. Oh, I got the words. Chorus, come on, chorus. I need the chorus. I need the chorus. That's the words I know. Oh, won't let go of you. Whoop. <laughs> she <laughs> I noticed this the first time and I was like, what did oh, she just say? I said, watch it over you. I was like, it's won't let go of you. No. Hey guys, end of the night. Um, Just got in. It is frigid outside, just so you know. But had a great day. Got my Starbucks. Didn't have a great morning with the frost. But the teenager did volunteer to get up and go out. And clean it off from now on so that's a bonus but that's the end of vlogmas day 15 and i will see you guys tomorrow which is tuesday for vlogmas day 16 hope you had a great monday smooches